in this video i want to go over uh, the basic functionality of product swap automation so product swap automation comes under the advanced menu and if you click on product swap automation it asks you for uh, we'll cover this part in a second video but over here first of all you can give any name to this automation you want and essentially what it's asking for you is a rule a swapping rule so you can set uh like rule which basically covers group of products you can say if uh, a and b are a part of the subscription they should be replaced with c or if a product a and product b are uh, part of a subscription they should be replaced with product c and d so it allows you to pick multiple products on both hand but usually people uh, want to swap you know just product a with b so that's also possible but uh, uh, what we have seen sometimes uh, mistakes that are being made is let's say you want to swap product a with product b and product c with product d so then don't club uh, you know both product a and c here like uh, if you do something like this and let's say if i give something like this uh, usually people expect that a uh, system would automatically detect that RSA 42 would be swapped with uh, 240 no that's not gonna happen what what this rule is gonna then expect is that both these products should be part of the subscription and then they would be swapped with these two products otherwise to create two different uh, products uh, you know automation rule so let's say in this one what I want is that um, uh, I wanna whenever I'm placing an order for RSA A2 it should be swapped with 240 and let's give it a, a you know reasonable name so i'm gonna actually use this only as a reasonable name for all right so uh, let's save it and we have the automation created now let's go to the storefront and look for this product i'm gonna create a subscription for this obviously this product is already configured uh, for subscription so like i can buy it as a subscription and now I come here I can buy it here and uh, you can even in subscription detail uh, you can even provide more details like hey this product is gonna be swapped with the product uh, this specific product you you have complete control over the customization we have also provided you a way to make this static so that instead of showing it like this it would be a static text uh, 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 customer doesn't need to hover over it it would just always be visible so all that is possible but i'm just gonna place an order for it so that you see how it's gonna work now here is an interesting thing uh if you would actually yeah so over here you see that it's still saying 162 dollar every week the reality is since this is gonna be swapped with another product uh which is this one uh we don't know the price of it yet but imagine if the, the price of it is like 180 dollar uh over here it would still say 162 dollar because uh shopify doesn't allow us to have any control over this particular page checkout is completely handled by shopify so we cannot basically change this price over here uh, however there is uh there is a workaround for it and i'll show you in the one of the uh other videos for product swap this one let's keep it simple so i just place i'm buying this subscription i'm on a test store so i can use my test credentials uh, test card number i mean and so at this time uh, you know your pro a new subscription is going to be created and uh, you would see that by the time it would come to our system the uh, the product that it would uh, basically say that um, customer has subscribed for is not this one but the other one uh, so and then there are multiple use cases of it uh, some of our merchants wanted to do that because uh, 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 you know they had a business scenario where uh, the item should be swapped immediately but i'll uh, in my other part of the you know other videos related to product swap i'll go over 
some of the use cases that you can solve with it so this is done let's see if we have got the subscription or not we have got the subscription here and let's see the details of it and as you can see it says it's saying 240 tire which is the uh, destination variant right what we uh, basically bought here is rsa a2 but over here you are saying over here you can even confirm it here in the upcoming orders it's always saying 240 so that's for that's about it for this video in uh, other videos for product swap i'll go more about the advanced use cases and what what other things you can do with it